Hello everyone, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to install Windows 11 in VMware. To start, smash that like button and subscribe to my channel and let's begin. So first thing we're gonna do is open any browser we have. Like I'm using Google Chrome, you can use Microsoft Edge or Firefox. Open new tab and type Windows 11 ISO download. Now open the first link you see. Scroll down until you find download Windows 11 disk image. Click here and choose Windows 11 multi edition ISO for x64 devices and click on download now. Select the language, I'm using the English, it will be good. Click on confirm. And 60 bit download. And boom, here we go. This is the file we need to install Windows 11. After we get the file right here, so I'm just gonna go to VMware and open it. Right click here, new virtual machine. Now, Select the typical because it's recommended. Next, now we're gonna choose the ISO file that we downloaded from Microsoft.com. I'm just gonna click on Browse, Desktop, and this is the file. Click Open. Sometimes you can see this that it says could not detect which operating system is in this disk image. It's no problem. We can fix this. Click on Next. So because we downloaded Windows 11, click here on Windows 10 and choose Windows 11 x64. And make sure that it says Microsoft Windows just right here. Click on next. Now you can name your virtual machine as any name as you want. Like I'm just gonna name it my first virtual machine. Click on next. Now it's gonna ask me to make a password for the TPM. I'm just gonna put a random password or click on generate right here and click next. Now select the size of your disk in Windows 11. I will go with 64 gigabytes. Click on next. And after we're done, it's gonna show us here the specifications of the virtual machine like it has 4 gigabytes of RAM, you can make it more by clicking on customize hardware. After you're done checking everything here and making sure that everything is as you want, click on finish. Click on power on this virtual machine. You can just enter the full screen from here. Now click enter. So when you see this error that it says not found EFI network, shut down the virtual machine. Click here, shut down guest, and go to edit virtual machine settings, go to options, advanced, and choose the BIOS option from here, click on OK, and try booting the virtual machine again. Hope you guys enjoyed my video, and thanks for watching, see you in the next video.